A Dallas hospital spokesman says the first Ebola patient diagnosed in the United States has died. Texas Health Presbyterian Hospital says Thomas Eric Duncan died Wednesday morning after fighting, quote, courageously against the disease. Duncan had arrived in Dallas September 20th from Liberia and fell ill a few days later. He was initially sent home after a visit to the ER, but was taken back to the hospital eight days later and had been kept in isolation ever since. Officials say 10 people had direct contact with Duncan while he was contagious. They are all being monitored. Emily Roseman, The Associated Press.